Not again. Man, we're scattered as usual. Stupid fool! Seriously! Splash! He had beans. Spike, look, Spike. I just woke up, bro. I'm not in the mood for your music right now, bro. Seriously, seriously, not right now. No, not when Nagito's trying to blow up the entire island. I don't have time to be dancing and grooving with you. Bro. Not today. This is a serious moment. Ding dong, bing bong. What? Out. Good job. Welcome back, A, hey, to another episode of yet. Let's do it. Good Don't hit me with a everyone. good morning, bro. Looks like Take Grand well, Rising. Then. Let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today. I give it my all every day, bro. Don't tell me that, bro. How about you pass around some martinis, bro? We're all in here thirsty, bro. Since when does a pool have a school? What room are you in? Where's Monami at in there? I've been resting since the explosion yesterday. But my body still hurts. A dull... Metallic sound is ringing in my ears and the back of my head feels hot. I can't think straight. But I can't afford to spend the whole day resting. I immediately left my college. My cottage, not college. <laughs> is this considered college? An academy, I don't know. Here you go, this dude. Relax, Kazuichi. I'm already knowing you finna... Oh, you still mad about Sonya? You'd be surprised, bro. We don't even want Sonya no more. You can have her, bro. Look at this dude hairline. Golly. How does it come down to his eye eyebrows, bro? I know y'all like, I'd rather have his than yours. Like, okay. Okay. You run around looking like Sonic the Hedgehog with pink hair then. Hey, it's you, right? You're the traitor, aren't you? What, what, what the hell are you saying? Come on. Just admit it already. If you don't, we're all gonna die! I am not the traitor, bro. Damn it! <laughs> I'm begging you! Doesn't matter who admits it. Just save me! Get a hold of yourself, Kazuichi. Complaining won't change anything, okay? Shut up! Shut up! I know that! What, what else can we do? We need to think about that with the others. So... Let's hurry over to the restaurant. Damn it. Damn it. You know that's how he cries, bro. My lips are so dry. I, I needed that as like a little chapstick, you know? Yeah. Fool, y'all. God. Ah, ah. Oh. It's you. Yo, you're covered in sweat. <laughs> I was looking for Nagito. This traitor stuff bugs the crap out of me. I won't forgive you. I just have to beat him up and make him tell us where the bombs are. But I can't find him anywhere. Is he hiding or something? Damn it. Damn it. I'm starting to get hungry. Maybe I should go back to the restaurant. Akane looks pretty frustrated. I guess that makes sense after what happened yesterday. Damn it. What's going to happen to us now? Uh, regardless, it is a beautiful day, bro. You know what? Low key, they're in they've been in quarantine this entire time, bro. It's not that bad of a look. I don't know where Nagito might be. Let's just get to the restaurant. If I was quarantined like this, I'd be quarantining for the rest of my life. Golly, bro. And now Chiaki want to show up probably because her little system is broken. I don't even care to read about it. Where were you? What are you what are you doing? Quiet! She's actually mad over her machine. That's hilarious. She's quietly staring at the arcade machine with sad eyes. <sighs> Good morning, Hajime. Ask her about the last time we was in here! Hey! Did this arcade machine break? Aww. It was too close to the explosion. I guess it couldn't take it. We're really mad over the... 
Man, this arcade machine was really popular. And it was so tough that even an elephant couldn't damage it. <sighs> but if it's broken, I can't do anything about it. I guess that's just how it is. It is what it is. Her shoulders are sagging pretty low. I feel some, I feel some granola. Yo. Yo, Hajime. How are you feeling? I'm not good. But not so bad that I can't move. Huh. Then you're okay. This is bad. I'm not okay at all. My ears are seriously ringing. Damn it. My eardrum is definitely ruptured. I need to hurry and have a doctor look at it. Um. So... What should we do now? However... What can we do? Hmm. So now he's just part of the crew again? This whole time we haven't seen him, but now he's just part of the clique, like... How troubling. If the traitor would just come forward, this problem would be resolved in no time. N Nagito, when the f Hey! Good morning! I came to motivate you guys since you're just laying around. Didn't I tell you yesterday that the bombs are set to go off in two days at noon? Well, you've got one day left. Come on, you better hurry. I mean, hurry? I'm not the one who has to come forward. The traitor does, right? Well, well, that's probably true. But even if this does depend on the traitor, your attitudes aren't admirable at all. Isn't that right? I mean, real hope is when you confront a hopeless difficulty that's standing before you, right? And despite that, you guys are already ready to give up. What does that mean? Or is this your limit? If so, it makes me laugh to think I could ever call you symbols of hope. This game is like... You bastard. You better knock it off. Now, now. Now, now. Keep your shirt on. I took the time to come bring you guys a valuable hint. Wouldn't it be bad if I changed my mind? Huh? You just say a hint. Bro, tell me. Nagito, what's your hint, bro? I'm glad. Oh, you finally have hope. That makes me happy. Hey! Who, who freaking cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the hint is. Well... Well, it's about the bomb's hiding place. I hid it somewhere you guys haven't been before. Huh? Somewhere we have not been before? You piss me off. I don't need any hints. I'll beat you up! Just tell us the answer. If you don't, I'll make you spit it out. Hey, 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 hey! Stop it! What are we gonna do if he sets off another bomb? Yep. Good judgment. Hey. If you guys have time to pick a fight with me, then you should start searching for the bombs already. And I'll just crush you to pieces later. Wow. And how scary. Look at where his hand placement is. Bro, stop it, bro. She don't want you. She want me. Why are you quiet and nervous right now? Dude. Hey. Why did you give us a hint? Why are you why are you asking that? Bro. Bro, I really hope the game don't end like this cuz this is so obvious, bro. See? Well, if the traitor you hear it all, she's like, "Why would you give us a hint like that?" Because we want to not die, bro. We want to leave. Don't you want to smash me? Just last week you gave me your draws. Now you don't want to Well, if the traitor sees their friend working hard, 
they may feel inclined to come forward. You know? You. Who cares? The traitor might not even exist. All we need to do is find the damn bombs. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Take care. He didn't even tell us anything I... yet. Oh, by the way, I'll be waiting here. So if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime. Right? Mr. or Miss Trader. We left the restaurant as Nagito's muffled laughter trailed behind us. Did he tell us? He just told us it's not Why? where we've been before. Kazuichi, why did you stop me? Huh? Huh? What are you talking about? <sighs> if you hadn't stopped me, I could have crushed Nagito to pieces. Bastard! You're too fired up, dumbass. Calm the f down at least. Everyone! More importantly, let us all head over to the ancient ruin. Hmm. Huh? The ruin? Please listen. Nagito said that the bombs are hidden somewhere we have not been before. So just as I thought. If that is the case, the inside of that ruin is the only place I can think of. Well. No. There was one other place too. What is it again? That castle at the amusement park? What's its name? Huh? Are you talking about the Natsumi Castle? Hey, hey, hey! You don't get it at all! He freaking means Nizumi Castle! Then, nigga, we have two places to choose from. Me over here correcting grammar like... But we won't be able to enter the ancient room without the password. So what should we do? Like... Password, huh? I'm guessing we still don't have any clues to that. Hey, hey. That probably goes for Nagito too. He wouldn't be able to enter without the password either, right? If that's the case, it's hard to think that the bombs were set inside the ancient ruin, right? So, I mean, we should try going to Nazumi Castle first. Are we screwed? But... Isn't that dangerous? I mean, what if that was Nagito's trap all along? Jeez. Monokuma's trap, Monami's trap, and now Nagito's trap. Dumbass. We keep worrying about some shit like that. We won't get anything done, dumbass. You. You're totally fired up too. Well, you. Splash. Hey. Anyway, we should try going there at least. We don't have time to stand around doing nothing. All right! Full speed ahead! Obviously. Full speed ahead! Splash! All right, we'll tackle on the Zumi Castle first. We out. Uh, we all moving as a unit. Uh, it's the best way to move is as a unit, y'all. Uh, get you a unit, move with them. That's the message. Nizumi Castle. All right, let me make sure that my, that my dog is okay. All right, we're here. Whoa. Damn it. Hey, don't you think this is definitely a trap? Like, once we go inside the castle, kaboom! No, I don't think that's gonna happen, dude. Nagito wants to weed out the traitor, not kill us all at the same time. That's true, but he's crazy. You know? Anyway, we need to keep trying and head over there. In the end, we still have to go. Anyway, let's go to Nizumi Castle. I hate, to, I hate to do this, but I really feel like they're trying to pin Kazurishi as like, you know, he's probably the killer since he's the one that wasn't, that doesn't want to go inside and search. But I'm looking at the people who hey, went there when hey. Nagito blew up the freaking lobby. Hey, check it out. Whoa. The entrance is destroyed. 
has been blown to bits. As if someone set off a bomb. I get it. If that's true, looks like this place was spot on. D damn it! Th then, then the bombs are inside here. Well, that's not even her voice. Th then the bombs are inside here. Damn right. That's what it looks like. Um. Then let's try going inside. But we need to be careful. We need to pay as much attention as we can. You're right. Then move! Let's go. After forcing a dry swallow, I nervously stepped through the door. And there. What is this place? I thought the inside would look more lighthearted than this. Um. The ambiance feels similar to that of a temple or a church. However, is it just me? Or does it seem like there are no bombs to be found here? Well. No, it's not just you. Hmm. If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be pretty big. But I don't see anything. I don't see a place where they could be hidden either. <gasps> then... The bombs aren't here? The bombs aren't here? But even so, I feel like... There's something suspicious here. But why? It feels like this place is different somehow. This feeling... It's the same feeling I felt when I first saw that ancient ruin. Bro. Sadamukiyaki. Hmm. Perhaps they're buried under the floor? Maybe? No, that's not it. There's no sign that the floors were dug up. Hmm. And where are the bombs? If the door was already blasted open, then there's no doubt that Nagito is here. I was gonna say not necessarily, but who the heck else has bombs? D damn it! There's no bombs here? Then where the heck are they? That is... If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be rather large. However, no matter where we search, we have not found anything like that at all. Right? Damn right. Hey, it looks like something is written on the floor. The floor? Huh? Here, look closely. Oh, wow. Hold on real quick. Hmm. Since we've never been here before, I thought this place was going to be it for sure. Huh? Nikito better not be making stuff up just to mess with us. Hmm? What is this? Oh, that's the, that's the password for the, for the ancient ruin. This font doesn't match the ambiance of the castle at all. It's almost like it was intentionally put here. Hey, everyone, come check this out. Huh? Huh? What's that? <laughs> to all subjects. I might make this a thumbnail. Subjects? Who are they talking about? Is it about us? I mean, there's more written below that. What does that mean? The password to guide everyone to the future is... Lies! What the heck is this? You can't even read the most important part. Like... What does the password to guide everyone to the future even mean? Uh, maybe it's... That password. Could it be? Could it be the password to access that ancient ruin? Guide everyone to the future. Maybe that refers to the Japanese word that is written on the door. Whoa! As expected of Miss Sonia. She only had to read it once to understand what it means. Like... But if we can't read the password, there's nothing we can do. That is... It is a rather tragic moment. Hey, hey. I wonder who erased this. Huh? Erased? So... I mean... 
it doesn't feel like it was a race naturally, right? It looks like it was forcibly scratched off. That's the only way I can see it. And somebody came here and carved that mess off. But Monomi and Monokuma shouldn't have entered this castle because they don't like mice, right? I won't forgive you. Then it was Nagito. He's the one who erased the password. Unforgivable. Unforgivable. <laughs> Splash. Perhaps. Nagito probably discovered the password here and used it to enter the room. Then he hid the bombs inside. Oh, sorry. Then he hid the bombs inside the ancient ruin. So he erased the password so we wouldn't be able to get near the bombs. Damn it! Damn it! That actually makes a lot of sense. If that's true, he gave us a hint even though he knew we wouldn't be able to use it. Don't tell me! Just so he could shove that reality in our faces? Damn it. There's no way we can enter that ancient ruin if we don't know the password. In the end, we can't do anything about the bombs unless the traitor comes forward. Did he lure us to this place so we'd be forced to confront that? Forcing us to confront the despair before us. Forcing us to confront how powerless we are. Damn it. That's what Monokuma would do. Uh, hey, um, whoever you are, you don't have to reveal yourself to us. Just tell Nagito. If you don't, you'll just end up dying too, you know? You. Hey, who are you saying that to? Uh, I don't know. I'm just saying it to everyone. Oh. Let's stop. Fighting among ourselves won't help anything. More importantly, let's work harder to find the password to that ancient ruin. Or clues that might relate to it. Hey. As long as we cooperate and explore all over the island, we might be able to find it, you know? D damn it! Are you telling us to look everywhere for a password that might not even exist? Hey. Who would leave a password here in the first place? And why? If it wasn't Monokuma or Monami, then who was it? We can't even answer that, so there's no way we'll be able to find anything. Please wait! Then what would you have us do? Just wait until we all die? That... is no different than when we were in the funhouse. And what did we learn there? Nothing! <laughs> we learned not to give up on living. Right? Hmm... Th that... Gundam was the one who said that. <laughs> Very well then! I should look for it on my own. Excuse me! S Sonya, hold on! But Sonya ignored me as I called for her and stormed out of the area. This shit is dramatic. Her shoulders were shaking a little. Harlem shaking. I'm sure of it. I mean... What? What the heck? Shut up! Shut up! Damn it, fine then! You wanna look for it? Well, fine! H hey! Kazuichi left Nizumi Castle and walked in the opposite direction of Sonya. Whoa! Didn't see that coming! Whoa! Well, what the hell are they doing? Now is not the time for infighting. Like... Never heard of that phrase. Well, it might be a good idea to work separately. Huh? Why? Huh? I mean, it's easier to move around that way, you know? In case someone wanted to secretly go meet someone. Hey, does that mean... Bro, I never noticed his tie, bro. Bro, if you don't take that demonic ass tie off, that's what made you stab yourself in the stomach when you got your feelings hurt. Like, stop it, bro. Take that off. Sorry. 
Just act like I was thinking out loud and pretend you weren't listening. Damn it. Not again. Man, we're scattered as usual. <laughs> Stupid fool. Seriously. <laughs> Splash. He had beans. If you think so, then please help. <laughs> yeah, leave it to me. I've got a secret plan. I won't forgive you. I just have to find the source of the problem and snap it off. Uh, Akane, what? What's your secret plan? Could it be? You know she's about to go body him. I have a bad feeling about the way Akane is acting. Akane only? Really? You don't? I'll run after her. It's best if we keep Akane away from Nagito for now. Far away. You're right. I guess I'll leave it to you. Yep. Okay. See you later. Chiaki ran after Akane. And from there, I was the only one left. What does this really mean? Who are the subjects that are being referred to? What's the password to guide everyone to the future? You need some rest, bro. I was the last to leave Nizumi Castle, and I wandered all over the island searching for clues to the password. But I didn't expect to find anything. And in the end, that's exactly what happened. And so, time passed by with his usual speed. Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. That's honestly the best kind of sleep. If you can, like, you know, hear the ocean while you sleep, phew, my nigga. I'm talking drool at the side of your mouth, a little bit of angular chalitis forming, like it is fire sleep, bro. Even after the, even after the announcement, I kept searching the island, but I didn't find what we were looking for. After a while, I, mean, I had forgotten what I was supposed to be looking for in the first place. In the end, after coming up empty-handed, I, I returned to the hotel. I didn't see anyone else on my way back here, but I mean, I also didn't see them while I was exploring either. That's because, even though this island is so vast, our numbers have drastically decreased since we arrived. Dang, they really have, bro. When I sit here and I think about all the, all the deaths that have happened, bro, I can't think of any other reason than that. I should go back. I thought he meant back to the, um, the castle. Nagito said time runs out at noon tomorrow. Another day's about to end. Which means there's only half a day left. I can't imagine the traitor will be revealed by then, since we don't even know if they really exist. And even if they do, it's possible they've forgotten that they're the traitor. All this thinking makes me feel like I should do something, but my brain and body were yearning for rest, probably because of all the walking I did today. As I dozed off, horrible disgusting images began to surface from the back of my mind one after the other but before I could focus on the specifics of those images somebody at my door oh he passed out I slowly sank into the depths of darkness hey um how are we already at a Monica Matita? I've only been playing for 30 minutes, but let's keep going. 
I think giving up is really important. If you don't give up on your dreams, they'll come true. It's just irresponsible and lazy encouragement. No matter how much you try without giving up, it's useless in the end. Persistence? Persistence? Persistence is just the worst. That's why I'm giving up. It's so important. But you can't give up if you don't even try. That's all from Monokuma Theater. That's actually the worst of all. You see, I found that Monokuma, bro. I love this little mix. I get to do all types of little voice things to it. All right. Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is gonna be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! The scenery this morning is the same as it ever was. I can see the sunlight peeking through the window. I can hear the faint sounds of waves crashing on the beach. But the bombs Nagito set are going to destroy all of this. Once time runs out at noon. At the moment, there's nothing about our situation that's changing for the better. I mean, usually I go to the restaurant, but what should I do today? As long as I remember what Nagito said. Oh, by the way. I'll be waiting here, so if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime, Mr. or Miss Trader. Sounds like he was planning to hang out at the restaurant all day. Wait a minute, he's going to be there all day? Then if anyone went to the restaurant like they normally do, bad feeling lingering in my chest grew with each beat of my frantic heart. I immediately ran out of my cottage. Is is he saying that we're going to see who could potentially be the traitor if we catch them at the restaurant? Is that where he's going with this? Sonia, what's the deal? Um. Good morning, Hajime. I. Um, about yesterday. I may have been somewhat careless with my words. I could not keep myself from snapping at what Kazuichi said, and I acted on my own. Thanks to my actions, everyone ended up going their own separate ways, right? Yeah, but what you said wasn't wrong either. Um, I have not given up yet. I will do my very best to live until the very end. If not, I will not be able to face Gundam. Nekumaru, or the others who have died. Poor thing. We all might get bodied. Who's up here? Who's up here? Who's up here? Who's up? The moment I set foot inside the restaurant, the worst case scenario was unfolding before me. Playtime's over. Now, where'd you hide the bombs? It's the kind of I don't know. I don't know, bro. <laughs> I don't look like I have no no bad time, bro. Whoa, bro. Nagito over there, like I'm getting uh, a little bit. I know he is, bro. This is a way to go out. That hurts, but I'll never tell. See what I'm saying? He kind of likes it, bro. If you really want me to spit it out, you should try torturing me or something. You don't like it? Stop it. Huh? Stop it right now. Torture? Maybe you can stab my fingers with that fork over there. All right. Or scoop my eyes out with that spoon. Nah, bro, lost me with this, bro. If you're not willing to fill me with despair, there's no way my hope will ever burn. Akane's hand suddenly wrapped around Nagito's neck and his face began turning a startling shade of- Bro, Haji, tackle her! Wrong with me! Just die already! Her clenched hands kept squeezing, 
even tighter as if she was trying to snap his neck instead of just strangling him. Hey, hey. What are you doing? Ah! Akane! This is bad. Hey, are you all right? Isn't he seriously going to die? But she was too overcome by rage to acknowledge us. Thank you. Who did it, Chiaki? Huh? Calm down, okay? You wouldn't do something like that, right? You're not the kind of person who would hurt someone. Right? See, it's all right. Yep, no problem. Chiaki looked like, I don't know, a Pac-Man ghost a little bit. Like, blinky girlfriend or something, bro. Like, there's a Pac-Man ghost that eerily remind me of her, bro. Sorry. I'm awake now. That's weird. What? What was I doing anyway? Hey, hey! Th that's what I want to ask! Don't tell me you were actually thinking about killing him! And that's when it happened. In the corner of my eye, I saw him slowly stand up. Thanks! Thank you, Akane. <laughs> Uh, I got to see my dead dog again. I haven't seen him in ages. Huh? Serves you right. You probably pissed off Akane in the first place. Wow. Hmm. I didn't mean to do that, though. Anyway, thank you for saving me. Looks like I owe you one. Then? If you sincerely mean that, please tell us the password to enter the ancient ruin. Huh? The password? To that ancient ruin? What are you gonna do with that? Y you... Don't play dumb! You've hidden the bombs inside that ruin, right? You're right. Yep, I did. <laughs> Until yesterday. Huh? Bro, I don't need to hear everybody's opinion on that. Hey, Nagito, what do you mean by until yesterday, dude? Well... There wasn't anything important inside the ancient ruin. Just some familiar scenery. Familiar scenery? Jeez. I got bored of it. Also, if I hid them in there, it would it would be completely meaningless. <sighs> so even if you had if, even if you had managed to learn the password to the ancient ruin, it has no meaning anymore. Now that I've moved the bomb somewhere else. Hey, hey. But they were inside that ancient ruin, right? I'm glad. Anyway, I guess it was right for me to move them. They were about to be found before the traitor confessed. Well... Well, it's not like it really matters. In fact, that might be better. Amazing! To make hope shine even brighter! Bastard! Stop talking crazy and tell us where you moved the bombs already! <laughs> Looks like you're in a hurry. Well, that's understandable. After all, time runs out today. Hey. Then let's begin the final battle. The final battle between the traitor and everyone else. <laughs> the final battle between hope and despair. The place I hit the bombs this time is a place you've all visited at least once. Hey, hey, hey. That's it. That's too broad! See? It shouldn't be that hard if you guys split up. For now. Why don't you guys search everywhere as fast as you can? As long as everyone cooperates, it should be easy to find out where the bombs are. What, what the heck? This is exciting! It's gonna be fine. I'm pretty sure everything will work out in the end. After all. There's no way hope can lose. <laughs> Absolute hope that can break through any despair can never lose in a place like this. I... And not only that, I believe in you all. I believe in the time we spent together. <laughs> and more than anything, I believe in my ultimate luck. So it's gonna be fine. 
As long as you believe in hope with all your hearts, the path should open. With that, Nikito walked away and left us with a sinister mixed message. I don't know why I read sinister mixed tape. Damn it! Why does he still have to be alive? Dumbass! Now is not the time to complain about stuff like that. Oh. Besides, we don't have time to fight among ourselves. You are right. We must hurry and search for the bombs. We should still have time to stop them. I mean... But based on all the places we searched, I don't know where else we should look. Shut the hell up! Only thing we can do is split up and cover as much ground as we can. There are exactly six of us. Each person should be in charge of searching an island. Damn it. Then leave this island to me. I already have the layout of this island in my mind. Just leave it to me. Leave it to me. Splash. If Akane has the first island, then I'll do the second one. <laughs> Miss Sonya should get the smallest island. Are you okay with searching the central island? Huh? Huh? But, but anyway, you're probably not good at covering ground anyway, right? It's fine. You can search the central island. Chiaki, you search the third island with the hospital. Hajime, you search the amusement park island. F that's the hardest island. And I'll handle the final island. All right, then let's do it. Mm. Let's hurry up and find those bombs so we can take care of Nagito once and for all. We stormed out of the restaurant and immediately left to search for the bombs. We didn't have time to even think about who the traitor is. But it's ironic. Nagito is the reason we're all splitting up, but the reason we're all cooperating is because of Nagito too. It's pretty damn ironic. Nagito is a fucking attention whore, bro. I'm in charge of searching the fourth island. I should search every nook and cranny. According to Nagito, the bombs have enough power to easily wipe out this entire island. Then it's probably not very small. I'll definitely find it. Bro, where am I supposed to start at? This is crazy. You got a doo-doo? You've never alerted me like that before. You about to leave? Usami! You about to give me a gift? Uh, you got some coin? Bye, sweet thing. I love you. It's so nice to take care of you for this short time. Be great in the world. Do great things. Damn, she's kind of an unfit mother. Why did you leave like that? Alright, let's keep going. It's possible that the bombs were placed inside this train. It's no use. I'm seeing it looks like a bomb. And I'm wrong. Oh, this actually be pretty easy if that's the case. I thought he was gonna have like a whole ass monologue for everything he saw. Bro, I know. What do you think I'm doing, bro? The roller coaster. I doubt it. This could be one of those things where I gotta click everything before I can actually leave, though. I'm out. Don't talk to me after this. Just let me run. What? I don't have time to deal with you. <laughs> did, did, did you see? Did you see? Huh? Rubber. Rubber. No. Rubber. Rubber. Emergency. Yeah. This is bad. My important thing got stolen. <laughs> Her important thing was stolen. Yo, yeah, right. Let's just keep going, bro. I don't know got time for that shit. Okay, back to the castle. Move. Whoever's trying to talk to me right now, move. Thank you, move. Whatever. We didn't even go inside. Whatever. Damn it. Bro, I'm not rushing. I'm not even... Go inside, go inside. The door is open. Oh! 
Looks like I can go inside, but it's possible that the bombs were hidden in here. All right, let's go. Monami's house, dude. It's not kind of a bot. It's not kind of a bot. How should I describe this place? It's so cloyingly cute that I feel like I'm gonna be sick. Yeah! No! Why? Why is Hajime in my house? The door was wide open. Oh, uh, oh, oh what? <laughs> as soon as she heard that, Monami walked to the door. What? Yeah, it's broken. My security system is broken. The robber probably did it. Oh, uh, no, a robber is no excuse. A female teacher with a young boy student in her house is just inappropriate. Yeah! I've been splattered with disgrace. Move. Gee, she's noisy. So this is a fit. What do you look like without this? Other plushies. Don't go touching my things without permission. They're important. Your own plushies? You must love yourself just like Monica. That's wrong. Y you're wrong. Please don't compare me to that thing. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have enough delicacy. Entering a woman's house without her permission and touching her things makes your teacher very sad. Got it? This will not be allowed. Hajime needs a class in morality. Delicacy and morality? Dude, I don't think those things have anything to do with each other. That's right. I shall give you a special private lesson after school. You just told me this was inappropriate. Now you want to give me private lessons behind the bleachers? Whoa. Miss Monami will slowly and thoroughly give you a good... Whoa, what? what? That, that sounds really inappropriate. Yeah, yeah, I know. I already made the joke, bro. Yeah. Once again, I've been splattered with disgrace. Such a sticky and what? You're the one who started saying it. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Are you monitoring us with these? <laughs> so I was right. The surveillance cameras all over the island and the footage those cameras are recording. You were watching that footage on these monitors. You were monitoring us, weren't you? <laughs> I was until Monokuma appeared. <laughs> I no longer have my magic stick. And because of that, Monokuma stole all of my powers. So I don't have the authority to monitor everyone anymore. These monitors are useless. Huh? What does that stick have to do with the surveillance cameras? <laughs> anyway, I can't monitor everyone anymore. <laughs> I have no other way of following your movements unless I rely on these somewhat nifty ears. Yo, I don't really understand, but does that mean Monokuma has been watching this from those surveillance cameras? That's wrong. No. It's probably not him either. In his current state, he shouldn't even need to use those cur those cameras. His power keeps increasing beyond my expectations. He surpassed any standard of measuring it. Hey, stop talking about stuff that doesn't make sense. Who's watching those surveillance cameras? Got it? They probably only matter to the outside. Outside? Do you mean the group that's controlling you and Monokuma? I see. So the people outside the island are watching the footage captured by the surveillance cameras and... <laughs> well, let's just brush that whole thing aside. There's no way I can do that. Um... But I can't say. Hey. Is she trying to cover it up by crying? That's exactly what Monokuma does. Just as a thought, I can't trust her at all. Dude, give me some info. No! So anyway, you said something about a robber. Are you talking about Monokuma? Hmm. Monokuma wouldn't do something as cheap as breaking the lock. 
Ever since he took over my power, he can do anything he wants on this island as long as he wills it. Power? Will, you're always so melodramatic. But if it wasn't Monokuma, does that mean the robber is one of us? <laughs> I I'm not doubting my students or anything, but my important thing was definitely stolen. What is your important thing anyway? <laughs> my treasure box. I don't think any of us would steal a Monami treasure box. But if someone did, why would they steal it in the first place? Um. Can you let me know if you find my treasure? <laughs> it's a magnificent treasure box car covered in sparkling pink lights. Well, if I come across <laughs> it... Alrighty, that's enough of your questions. Now it's my turn to question you. Me. Hey. Why did you suddenly come to this amusement park? It's strange that you're walking around alone. Did something happen? Something did happen. Huh? huh? That's right. I don't have time to waste at a place like this. Hey, I need to ask you an important question. Do you know where they are? Somewhere on Jabberwock Island, Nagito. Hey! Hey! Why hello there! Why? Why hello there, Monami? Wanna play with your big brother? Monokuma? Well, what's with your sudden invitation? We've never played before. <laughs> Come on, everyone's busy. You shouldn't interfere. Damn it! So hurry up and come play with me! <laughs> oh, my ears! Please don't pull my ears. I'll leave the rest to you. I'll let you students handle the rest. Do your best. <laughs> he always interferes whenever we're discussing something important. I guess he really is monitoring us. No. Now it's not the time to complain. I should get back to searching for the bombs. I shouldn't waste any more time. I leapt. I leaped. Leapt? Leapt. I leapt out of the Monami house and returned to searching for the bombs. Hey. Hajime. I, I found them. You found them? Damn it. Yeah, a shit ton of bombs were piled on top of each other. God damn. I didn't expect to find actual bombs. Where'd you find them? Near that stupid factory where the life-size Monokuma plushies are made. The plushie factory. Got it. I'll go tell Kazuichi and Akane. Can you tell Sonya and Chiaki? Yeah, yeah, got it. Damn it. We'll meet them in front of the bombs later. Meet in front of the bombs. But what's gonna happen after that? Will we be able to stop them? No, there's no point thinking about that right now. I need to tell Sonya and Chiaki about the bombs first. Central and okay, bet. Run, boy. Okay, she should she should be here. She should be here. She should be here. Okay, but the only place on this island where the bombs can probably be hidden is Jabberwock Park. If that's the case, maybe someone is searching there. Bet, 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 bet. Run, 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 run. There. Go, 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 go. Bro, am I going to get to see my dog hatch before this game ends? I hope so. I want to see what the next installment is. Huh? That's weird. I don't see it anywhere. Hey, Sonya, hey! I'm right here! Too bad. Just kidding! It's only me. Yes, indeed. Hajime used to call Sonya, but nothing happened. Because she's already gone to a faraway place. Huh? <laughs> Just kidding. If you're looking for Sonya, she was walking around near the military base. The military base? The one on the final island? Did she already hear about the bombs? Is that why she went to the final island? But even so, there's no reason for her to be at the military base because the bombs were found at the plushie factory. What are you doing there? I don't really understand, but I'll head over uh, there after I talk to Shiaki. 
Third island. All right. All right. Fast travel. I ain't got time for this. Bro, let me fast travel there. DS. I'm probably going to run into somebody on the way there or something. It is. It's Chiaki. Chiaki, I've been looking for you. What are you quiet for? What happened? Don't respond so slowly. It's the bombs. We found the bombs. Hurry over to the plushie factory. Are you listening? This is no time to space out. Yep. Ah, you're right. The bombs are bad, right? We gotta... I'll head over. At least be a little more nervous. Even in a situation like this, she moves at a snail's pace. All right, I should hurry over to the final island and meet up with Sonya at the military base. We out. Fake ass tumbleweed. Move, 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 move. Everybody move. Before I go to the pleasure factory, I need to meet up with Sonya at the military base. Wasting no time today. Wasting no time today. Wasting no time today. Fake ass bait supreme logo on the, on the, on the thing. Sonya. There she is. What is she doing in a place like this? Yo, Sonya. What are you? Bro, I'm trying to click her, bro. Looks like Sonya is digging around the back of that truck. Hey, what are you doing? Uh, All right. My. Hajime. Please don't startle me. I am concerned. Ooh. I thought my heart was going to explode. Explode. And anyway, what are you doing here? Weren't you searching the central island? Um. I was, but there was something I needed to confirm here. Never mind that for now. We found them. Um, what did you find? The bombs! Obviously, they found the bombs at the plushy factory. Huh? Huh? The bombs are at the factory? Let's hurry over to the factory. The others should already be there, too. What are you stalling for? If we don't hurry, it'll be too late. You are right. I understand. Bro, you're looking crazy right now, dude. You pissing me off. I shall make my way there shortly. So please go on with. We found the bombs. Huh? I am sorry. It is going to be fine. I will catch up with you soon. Bye, bitch. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. When they act like that, bro, bro, we're about to die, bro. This is life and death, bro. <laughs> Sonya, Sonya and Chiaki both pissing me off. I just want to mush both their face. You tried it. I'm on alert now. High alert now, y'all. But why is she even at the military base? I can just ask her later. Anyway, the bombs are the biggest priority. I should hurry over to the plushie factory. Bro, how many times you gonna, you gonna say the word plushie factory, dude? Huh? Hmm. Where's Sonya? I told her about the bombs, but she wouldn't listen to me. She said she'd catch up with us later. Huh? Later? Why? She should know that now it isn't the time for that, but... Well... Can... I go bring her? Dumbass! Do you really think there's time for that, you fucking dumbass? You're right. We need to stop the bombs first. Damn it! All right, let's go! 
we stilled our nerves and charged into the factory. The first thing I noticed was the roaring engine of a nearby... How does Nikito know how to do any of this? Motherfucker hooked up a fruit by the foot. Two long ass fruit by the foots. And is about to explode an island. How? I'd expect something like that from Kazuichi at the most. But you, Nagito, what is your talent? Being unlucky. You should have exploded from the engine. A truck? Why? Or he's the ultimate lucky student. That's what it is. Or is it unlucky? I can't remember, bro. What's that thing over there? Was that there when I first came in here? Damn right. Look closely. The bombs are right in front of us. Bro, I see them, bro. What do you want me to do? I'm clicking. What do you want me to do? Click this? There's a truck parked in the middle of the factory. A lot of dangerous looking objects are loaded on the bed on the bed of the truck. Hey, 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 hey! Those things! On top of the bed. Is that it? Damn it. I don't know how powerful they are or if they have enough power to blow up the entire island, but if there are that many, it must be extremely powerful. Did he really drive this truck and carry over all these bombs? That's what I'm wondering, bro. Damn it. Kazuichi, can't you disarm these bombs? You're good at that kind of stuff, right? Hmm. I thought I could, but it looks like the engine is also acting as a detonator. Damn it. So that's why the engine is still running. The bombs are set up so when the engine stops running, the insulator will blow off and trigger the explosion. Yeah. I don't care how it's built. Can you disarm it or not? Uh, it's impossible. I don't have enough time. The main detonator was put inside this bulky metal box and welded shut. Ah! There's no way I can disarm it if I can't get this thing open. So is it gonna take you a long time? It's not good. I mean, it's almost- This is bad. Yeah, noon. Mm. What if we use the tools at the military base? Hey, hey, hey. We don't have time for that. The truck's engine is the detonator, right? Then can't we stall for time by adding some gasoline? It's no use. The fuel cap has been welded on too. I'm gonna do it! Then I'll just drive the truck into the sea. Bastard! You can't. You don't even have a... That's your number one argument, bro? The fact that you don't have a license, bro? Are you seriously gonna stop me? I thought your family was all about breaking the law. Damn it. But even that's impossible. There's a chain wrapped around the wheel. If we can't disarm the bomb, stall for time or move the truck, there's nothing we can do. Hey, hey. Hey, check it out. Huh? See? There's some kind of machine on top of that metal box Kazuichi mentioned. Huh? Huh? The machine on top of the box? Hmm. Oh, this. This looks like a card reader. A card reader. Hmm. Maybe we can disarm the bomb if we swipe the key card. Are you serious? What? Hmm. Wait. It might be possible. Nagito wouldn't be able to disarm these bombs if he didn't leave some way of doing that. Right? Huh? Maybe he never planned to disarm them from the start. Mm. No, I don't think that's it. Nagito is probably trying to make us do something here. Yeah, admit who's the traitor. What do you mean, something? So... Knowing Nagito, there's definitely some kind of theme to this, I think. Theme. <laughs> that bastard probably would do something messed up like that. All right. Then we gotta find that. Leave it to me. I'm not about to do that no more, bro. 
Nagito is trying to make us do something here? That's true. What's he trying to make us do this time? Bro. Digging here, maybe? I don't know, bro. Instead of Monokuma's life-size plushies, there's something else in front of me I can't stop staring at. Was that there the last time I came here? Ooh. Not the big-ass crane? Ooh. There's a laptop on top of the stop conveyor belt. This wasn't here the last time I came here, right? How suspicious. Hmm. It looks suspicious. It might be good if we examine it thoroughly. Yeah, you're right. As soon as I touched the laptop, some kind of program began running all of a sudden. And almost immediately, a, vo a video started playing. Hello there. Why, hello everyone. Great work. Maybe a thumbnail. So you really found the bombs, huh? Believing in you was completely worth it. This dude trying to play Saw games? Like, stop it, bro. Nagito. Perhaps. It looks like a video message from Nagito. You pissed me off. A video message? If he's got something to say, he can say it to our faces. Hey, bastard. Just hold on. For now, let's just watch this through the, to the end. Now then. Bro, Nagito, do your own voice acting, bro. I'm tired. It's been an hour and 15, bro. Now then. Now that you guys have, fin have found the bombs, all you need to do is stop it. To tell you the truth, it's actually not that hard to do. You see, there's a card reader on top of the metal box. As long as you can scan an e handbook. Oh! It will disarm the bombs. Leave it to me. All right, if that's the case, then just leave it to me. However. Well. It won't work with just any student handbook. If you want to disarm that bomb. You have to use the traitor student handbook. To be honest, I found out who the traitor was after secretly monitoring everyone's activity. But I was a little annoyed that they never came forward. So if things stay this way, it'll look like I lost, right? That's why I was thinking I should have another battle. So this is going to be your last chance, traitor. What are you gonna do? Everyone's life depends on you. Whether or not you save them is up to you. Now then, I wonder how this is going to end. Will the traitor's identity finally be revealed? Ooh! Ah! And with that, the video ended. The traitor's student handbook don't tell me. So, so that's it? This was also a trap. To weed out the traitor. Hey, hey! Is there seriously a traitor? If there is, they should have come forward already. I mean, their life is in danger too, you know? That's true, but... Yeah! Stop whining and complaining. We should do it one at a time. You... Just don't be stupid. What if someone else besides the traitor uses their handbook? Hey, hey. It's... Oh, wow. So if it's the wrong one, it'll explode. Is that what I'm seeing? It's really stupid to be fighting over something like this. Chiaki, put your, ha put your handbook down first. Put your handbook down there first. And so, with an annoyed expression on her face, Chiaki walked over to the bombs without saying a word took her handbook out of her pocket. Huh? And without hesitating, swiped the card reader.
I don't know what I'm supposed to do next, y'all. I'm kind of lost now. It looks like it was wrong. See? Who's next? Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? If you make a mistake, the bombs might blow up. You think so? But they didn't. Hey! It's just a. F okay, put your next, Kazuichi. Your next. Anyway. Your next. Well, I guess Chiaki's not the traitor. That just blew my whole theory out the water, bro. I don't think the traitor would have swiped their handbook right away like she did. So what are we gonna do? Who wants to try next? Hey, hey, hey! But like I said, don't act so careless. Swiping the wrong card might be safe. But only once, you know? Huh? Hey, what happened? Well... Nothing! I, I might just be overthinking it, but... The engine somehow sounds... Just then, Kazuichi's face turned pale and he rushed over to the truck. And then, as he tilted his head toward the engine, he suddenly shouted. Ah! It's out of gas! What'd you say? Huh? This nigga capping, bro. I'm looking at Kazuichi like Big Cap. Big Capalapolis. What's gonna happen if there's no gas? Ah! I already told you, it's gonna blow! But isn't it too soon? I mean, there's still time until noon. Are you kidding me? Did Nikito miscalculate? Are you serious? Miscalculate? Ah! Uh, if you're gonna set us up, at least get your calculations right, damn it! Damn it. At, at least Monokuma knows how to keep a schedule. Are you serious? Hey, can't we do anything about it? Is there something we can do? Yeah. Yeah, there's only one thing we can ah! do. What is it? What do we have to do? Damn it! Are you kidding me? Are you effing serious? <laughs> then we should run. With those words, we started sprinting away. And that's what he was actually right. It is all right. It is not a bomb. Huh? All of a sudden, the inside of the factory began overflowing with dazzling light. Huh? Monokuma Theater, hurry up, bro. Let me let me end this video, dude. I'm not about to play with Nagito, bro. W what the hell is this? Um, Looks like they're fireworks. Fireworks. While we stood there dumbfounded, the fireworks slowly decreased their intensity. And eventually. Oh my! Um, this means <gasps> it wasn't a bomb, huh? What the heck? I mean, Nagito said. Um. Nagito definitely bombed the entire lobby with explosions and fire, bro. I don't know what. I don't know why they feel dumbfounded about this. Like, I mean, I get why they feel dumbfounded, but I don't. I don't blame their the worry at all. So. It is just as I thought. As you thought. Hey, hey. hey, everyone. Look over there. The laptop. It looks like it's playing another video. Is it Nagito again? Is it your hero? <laughs> so, were you surprised? Seriously, think about it. Do you really think there are enough bombs to blow up an entire island? <laughs> Even if there were, a guy like me would never be able to use them. Damn it! So it was all a bluff. Then, what was the bomb he detonated at the hotel? Um, Nikito went to the octagon inside the funhouse, right? Don't tell me! Is that where he got that bomb? But it definitely wasn't strong enough to blow up an island. Nikito wasn't lying about that. You pissed me off. Is he still watching us from somewhere? If he's not, then how did he time his message so perfectly? Hmm. No, it looks like the video was set to play after the explosion by a wireless signal from the detonator. But 
Why did he have to use the video message? That's the one thing I don't get. Hey, hey. Let's think about that after we've watched the whole thing. You're right. Hey. So how did it go? Did the trader come? Why does it say Hajime said that? So how did it go? Did the trader come forward? If I had to guess, well, I'd say they didn't, right? So then, which is it? It'd make me very happy if you guys could tell me. I'll be at the warehouse next door waiting for your answer. From there, we'll compare our answers and I'll let you know who the trader really is. See you later. The warehouse next door? That's where Nagito is? I won't forgive you. This time I'll make sure to beat the crap out of him. That's right. Then I'll deliver the final blow and smash his head in with this wrench. Jeez. You bastards. What are you saying? Bastard. You guys can just beat the shit out of him because I'm the one who's gonna fucking kill him. Mm. You guys, you've totally flipped your lids. I'm trying to flip your lids. Now's not the time to be calm. We need to stop them. That is an order. You are right. Let us make haste. How are we going then? Fireworks, hilarious. Let's get to the warehouse. Let's get to the warehouse. Let's get to the warehouse. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Let's huh? get to the warehouse. I'm going to do it. I'm going to beat the crap out of them. Hey, hey, I totally know how you feel, but calm Wait. down. Shut up. Huh? Everyone's feet came to a grinding halt. Their red, angry faces instantly transformed into a look of caution. A Akane, what is it? Huh. Can you hear something? It's coming from the other side of this door. The other side of this door? As I listen carefully, I can make out a soft sound coming from the inside of the warehouse. Music? What's he planning? Is this another one of Nagito's traps? Huh? Maybe the moment we open the door, a real bomb is gonna go kaboom! Now then. All right, let's open it and find out. Huh? Please do not, Akane. It is dangerous. Yo. It's fine. I'll open it slowly. No, that's not the problem. Leave it to me. Seriously, I'll be fine. It'll be fine. With those words, Akane brushed off everyone's warnings and slowly opened the door to the warehouse. Huh? It's not opening. Is there something blocking the door? I can barely open it. Hey, hey. I, I knew it. It's a trap. Seriously, just stop it, okay? You? Didn't I tell you it'll be fine? And I just got to use a little more force. What? What happened to opening it slowly? Akane ignored their protests and with a mighty kick, the door flew open. Ah! It's gonna blow up! Instinctively, we tensed our bodies and braced ourselves. But... Huh? Hmm? What's this? What happened? Yo! Look inside. It sure is dark. Looks like there aren't any lights on. Is Nagito really in here? Nagito, okay. The inside of the warehouse felt even darker because our eyes were still used to the bright uh, sunlight outside. Within that darkness, a loud hymnal blared throughout the warehouse at full volume. Hey, do you guys hear something? That is so creepy. Yeah, though. it's really damn loud. <laughs> Does Nagito like listening to this depressing crap? No, I'm not talking about the music. And as if on cue, it suddenly started. It's on fire! A fearsome blaze suddenly began dancing inside the dark warehouse, like fiery wings spreading before Whoa! us. Whoa! What? What's going on? For now, we must extinguish these flames! Let us hurry and put them out! Hey, hey! But how are we supposed to put this fire out? 
There should be a fire extinguishing supplies inside the factory break room. Perhaps we should use those. Damn it. Got it. Let's head to the break room. After listening to Sonya, we ran into the factory. Bro, y'all don't need me to do this, bro. The break room is here, right? Fuck are those frogs? All right. Where are the fire extinguisher supplies? Oh, bet. A huge supply of lined up plastic bottles. It looks like there's some kind of liquid inside them. You found it! Those are fire grenades! Fire grenades. They're basic fire extinguishing goods. When you throw them at a fire, the container breaks and the chemical inside it puts strange, out the fire. No? But this is strange. The last time I peeked inside this place, I recall seeing other fire extinguishing supplies too. Hey! This should be plenty! Let's hurry up and go back to the warehouse! We grabbed all the fire grenades and rushed back to the warehouse. Dude, if you don't start throwing them things in there, bro. Now. Um, Make sure you don't get too close to the fire. It's dangerous. Then. Take care not to inhale the smoke as well. We should throw the grenades from the door at the same time. Damn it. Looks like the curtain in the back is burning up. I just have to aim for that, right? I'm gonna do it. All right, let's go. Look at, look at uh, Kazuichi trying to hit a little bit of filet layup. Like, stop it, bro. We aimed for the curtain in the back and threw all the fire grenades one after the other. But hey, is it just me? Or does it feel like the fire's not going out at all? The curtain absorbed the impact of the thrown grenades, which fell on the floor and shattered. They were completely ineffective at extinguishing the burning does it curtain. Not seem like the fire is intensifying? Somebody changed the liquid. Somebody changed the, the liquid. Fire continues to rise. It will inflame the ceiling. Somebody changed the liquid, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is getting horrible right now. These thumbnails is it though. This is bad. We've already used up all the fire grenades. But what are we gonna do? All we can do now is pray for rain! Just don't be stupid! There's no way it'll conveniently start raining if we pray for it! It's raining? So this is the power of the Japanese Terra That's not it. It looks like the sprinklers activated. Oh, the sprinklers. They must have detected the smoke and turned on. Water continued to vigorously pour out onto the spree out of the sprinklers. And after a while, the fire in the warehouse was completely extinguished. L looks like the fire is out. Um, that is a relief. What? The hell! <gasps> oh, man! My merch is drenched! It got splattered with water and now it's soaked! It's so wet! Hey, hey. Hey, is it okay to look inside now? Just a minute. Huh? Uh, uh, time out! Time out! You can't! Nuh uh, no way! Why? Why can't we go inside? Hey, um. Smoking hazardous gas are still spread throughout the warehouse, so it's gotta ventilate for a while. Well, yeah. Well, I guess you're right. It'd be a problem if we breathed in any lingering smoke. So... So for the sake of your health, please wait for just a little while. While you're waiting, why don't you check out the Monokuma Theater I freshly prepared? Thank God, because the nigga... You know, this hurts. You're so stupid. Everything is a lie. Monokuma doesn't exist. The Monokuma Theater doesn't exist. Everything is fiction. There's no meaning whatsoever. There's no relationship whatsoever. Everything was made. Monokuma can't be found anywhere. <laughs> what are you doing here anyway? Bro. Bro. Yes, indeed. Bro. Bro, that's two Monokuma theaters for y'all.
I don't know where this mess is, is going from, bro. I'm probably going to eat and hop right back on this and keep it going, bro. But that goes another episode of that dang and roll. But two, I have no clue anymore. <laughs> bro, when I started this, I had, I knew for sure who I thought was the traitor. Now, we're right back to being up in the air. Chiaki whole handbook worked. That gas, the fire extinguishing thing, that was strange. I'm afraid what we're gonna find when that when that smoke clears. I'm not gonna say anything right now, but I'm afraid of what we're gonna see when that smoke clears. But until then, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you subscribe if you are new. Hit that bell so you know when I'm posting videos and premiering them. Love each and every one of you, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.